going to be showing you how to do is how to get two finger scrolling in Windows. And if you have a Windows laptop with a horrendous touchpad like I do, this will probably help you a lot. Um, so the first thing that you need to be aware of is that this is only available for Synaptics touchpads. Now if you don't know what kind of touchpad you have, you can go to start, <clears throat> type in mouse, and open up the mouse settings and control panel. And uh, it'll tell you right here where my mouse is uh, what type of touchpad you have. And I do indeed have a synaptic touchpad. So that's good. Um, now the second thing that you're going to need to do is download the program. And I have provided a link in the description. And uh, it'll take you to this page here. And what you're going to want to do is just scroll down to the download links. And you can use either of these. Um, so I'll just click the Mediafire one. And go ahead and download that. Now you're going to want to click that Show in Folder um, and Extract All. Okay. All right, so now that that's extracted, this is the application, and to get it running, all you have to do is uh, double-click that, and it will start up, and you can use your two-finger scrolling. However, what I would recommend doing is moving it somewhere out of your downloads folder. Um, for me, I, I copied this application, and I moved it to uh, a location in my documents. Let's see. I have it right here. Um, so after you have moved it to wherever you want, uh, double click it and it will start in the system tray right here. And to change the settings, you can right click it and go to settings. Uh, now it's set up uh, pretty well to begin with. There isn't, there shouldn't be a whole lot of things that you need to change. Um, there's different settings right here. There's also gestures which don't really work too well so I disabled those. The one thing that I did do is I, uh, I turned the acceleration uh, way low because the acceleration was too high to begin with and it was making things kind of difficult. So I just turned the acceleration uh, down. But other than that, I pretty much kept the uh, settings at default. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a really easy uh, little application to configure. And let's do a little test here. Um, it's very smooth and it's almost, if you've ever used a Mac before, it's very much like that. Um, let's maximize this. Let's see, it's really smooth. And uh, in my opinion, it's a must have. Um, but anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed this and I hope this helps someone. So if you want future videos like this, um, you can subscribe to my channel and uh, you can leave me a comment and let me know if you liked it or if you didn't like it, what I can change. So that is helpful too. Uh, anyway, I will see you all next time.